Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Um, so I just want to put this quick video out just because uh, I hope you guys have been enjoying the new live stream that I did the other day. It was the my pal Mark was playing uh, Spider Man Two. Obviously, um, there will be another part for that, guys. Um, obviously, like there will be another part for that coming very, very, very soon. Also, I hope you enjoy the new setup for the mic. The mic was obviously here, but obviously I've moved it about and stuff. Um, but I uh, hope you guys have been enjoying the setup. I uh, hope you guys enjoy it even more when I do a stream more on YouTube and also, um, fucking, uh, Twitch and stuff. Um, basically, um, there's some things I really want to talk about in this video, but, um, most of the stuff I just want to cover is like, you know, some of you guys aren't really subscribed to the channel, so if you could, uh, please subscribe. Uh, if you're new, it would be really appreciated. I'm trying to get over 7,000 again. I was at 7,100 and something once before in my life. And then it just went down the drain, I think, for after a while because I didn't post as much and stuff. But I will be posting a lot more on YouTube and stuff. And I, I, I do... I don't want to get my channel banned. I know sometimes I do have a joke, but in all seriousness, I don't want to get my, ch my channel banned or anything like that. I just... I'm just sick of fucking YouTube taking the piss all the time. So, YouTube, if you watch this video, or if you are mon not monetizing, but moderating this and watching it back or whatever, please do not copyright strike me or give me a warning for what I say or whatever I do during the video. It's just the fact that you've been taking the piss for quite a while and you need to stop. But, obviously, you know, hopefully we can try and move forward. Um, obviously there's been a couple of things, guys, that's been going on in my life at the moment. Not going to say really most of the majority of it, but uh, it's been some, like, serious shit. You may know one of my good friends, uh, Kami1912, which, yes, that's his fucking gamer tag. He used to be one of my friends on 360, and also to this day. Not anymore, guys. Not anymore. Not anymore. Because he decided to be a dickhead and decided to blame me for it. I don't really want to start, you know, going through the whole thing. Um, if you want me to dis to, to uh, discuss it, um, then if we reach over 7,000, I will make that a video for you guys. And I will show all the messages... And I'll show what I said to him, but I'll sh obviously blur some of it out because of YouTube stuff. But, uh, yeah, he's been pretty much, like, being a dickhead just because I didn't play fucking Dying Light 2 with him. When I said to him that I'll try to play Dying Light 2 with him, I was just busy. But he does not understand the meaning of busy because all he does, guys, and do you know what? I'll tell you the truth, the thing that he has on his Twitch, I designed it for him. His banner, I designed for him for fucking free. He's lucky I did not charge him for that. Um, because most of these people do. But that's because I was a good friend, you know? And, um, but yeah, he's just decided to be a right dick um, for no apparent reason whatsoever. And he's tried to blame me for it, like he always does. He blames everybody else but himself. He has got some fucking ego, by the way. And he treats his friends like shit, even sometimes Tyler. He treats Tyler like shit by fucking saying shit behind his back consistently. Like, it's a fucking joke. Like, don't get me wrong. I was on board with it, but I was just taking his fucking side, because, you know, if I fucking open my mouth, he just gets on a fucking tangent. Um, I know this video seems like me just fucking bragging about him, but honestly, it's not mostly that. There is other things I'm going to be covering in this video. Um, so after we get done drag bragging about this bastard, then we'll go on to the actual good bit, the good things in this video, actually. Um, because I don't want to make this video too long, obviously. There will be a new 
channel banner coming soon. I know I've just put my logo with my name at the top just now. It's because I'm working on a a new banner for the channel. Uh, don't know when it'll be it'll be released yet. Um, there's going to be new updates on the Discord server. Um, that I have. Um. So, if any of you guys are in the Discord at this moment in time and there's changes and you can access some stuff, it's probably that. Oh. Pardon me. But, um, but yeah guys, join the Discord. For any, for any people that is new, join the Discord. I'll leave a link down below in the description. Make sure you join and um, you can probably join with me and my friends and stuff and my girlfriend as well. And also... Um, a few other followers that are on Twitch as well that I usually sometimes play with and stuff like that. And uh, also, I just want to give a special shout out to um, somebody that I play with on Fortnite sometimes. And he is nearly at 7,000, guys. He's nearly overtook me, which is pretty fucking shocking. But obviously, you know, it doesn't really matter because I've kind of got ahead of him anyway on Twitch. So, you know, it doesn't really matter. But, um, but he's, been, he's been really good to me and stuff like that, you know helping me out and obviously I've been kind of like helping him out with his chat and stuff so make sure to subscribe to um uh, Rikiri plays um I'll leave a link for his channel as well in the description go and check him out he's a uh, basically like a Fortnite streamer and he plays other games as well I think he plays like Final Fantasy and stuff like that so um go and check him out guys he's actually quite pretty good um uh he's a pretty good Fortnite player but, you know, I'm the king. <laughs> but, um, uh, he's really good and he's quite good to have a laugh with. And he does play a lot, a lot, with, a lot with his subscribers and stuff. Kind of like what I do with my followers and all that on Twitch. Um, so go and check him out. But, yeah, back to the subject, what we were on. Um, yeah, Cameron, that's right. Um, so he basically, you know, made the whole tangent just because I did not play, like, like I said, Dying Light 2 with him. Because I have my own personal life. I have a girlfriend and obviously stuff like that and you know I like to spend time with her and stuff like that and you know I just like to spend time with my pals as well so you know that's what I was doing for the last few weeks or a few days should I say and he basically knows that I don't really message a lot on snapchat and sometimes my snapchat is basically for my twitch and you know you know like for people to admin stuff right he always brags about that I don't message him back. That was one thing he always bragged about. And then when I do message him back, he's always asking me to play Dying Light 2 with him, which I didn't have a problem with. I did go on it. And basically, he um he was just bragging about shit. And uh, every time I came on, he was, like, he was always like, oh, play Elder Scrolls, play Elder Scrolls. Scrolls, play this, play that, and I'm like, bro, I've got a ton of games to finish first, and I'm not doing that as an excuse, like, I can even show you the games that I have on my Xbox that I need, and I've got some new games that I'm playing as well, but he just kept bragging about playing fucking Dying Light 2 when the new update came out, and I was gonna do it, I was gonna do it, but, you know, obviously, like, Jade was here, right, that's my girlfriend's name, right, because you guys know her from probably you know, from the background of when Mark was streaming the other night on, you know, YouTube. And obviously, if you guys that are, are subscribed, you know, that follow me on Twitch as well, you would understand that, you know, Jade's been in some of the streams and she does the Sims sometimes. So, yeah. Basically, Cameron was pure fucking bitching and complaining just because I wasn't on Dying Light. And he spammed me fucking two messages first. Uh, that was like, I can't remember what day it was. A few days ago, I think. And then I didn't respond to him because I couldn't be fucked because I just knew I would just be, like, talking to a brick wall talking to him because he would have just made a big fucking big deal out of it. He, is, he did admit he was wrong and he apologised. So I, I was thinking about, you know, being like, you know what, all right, we'll talk out and stuff like that, you know, because like, sometimes pals have fallouts and stuff. Then, the next few days after that, he fucking spams me now when I change my name on Xbox because obviously of reasons, because of that shit, and obviously just because I felt like a change and stuff. He spams me fucking messages 
And then he's like, fucking saying shit like, uh, Bro, why do you think that Battlefield's better than Dying Light 1? I mean, Dying Light 2? Like, uh, you know, the only reason you're saying that is because Star Wars is a PvP game. Uh, mate, right. I need to say this, right? I know this video may be a bit longer, I'm sorry, guys. Cameron, if you watch this video, or if this is a premiere and you're watching it live, okay? Or even at that, right? Whenever the hell I, re I re release this, right? Whenever you see this, if you still watch my YouTube, I know Star Wars is a fucking PvP. I know Dying Light 2 isn't. But what I'm saying is, Dying Light 2, right, is good, but it's not as good as the first. And you even admitted that, but you said the guns were better. I don't think the guns are. And to be honest, right, what the fuck was the big hype? It's just fucking re recycled content that you've already fucking played in the first game. Like Call of Duty, for example, right? It's like, you get hyped for that, but it's then like the recycled pish like they had from Modern Warfare 2 and Modern Warfare 3. That's the same shit like Dying Light. Only Dying Light 1 had a lot more content than Dying Light 2. It's 2024. Dying Light 2 has been taking absolutely... Dying Light 2 has been the worst release because it had bugs. Yes, it's been patched, some of the stuff. There's glitches being patched, fair enough. They did add a performance mode, fair enough. They did upgrade the textures, fair enough. They did have, you know, an interview, right? But look on Twitch. Look on Twitch. Look on Steam. Nobody's really fucking playing Dying Light 2 anymore. The game is dead. Same like COD, like Modern Warfare 3 and Warzone. They're dead. I don't care what you say. It's the same with fucking Elder Scrolls as well, online. The only time these titles peak is when there's new content. And it's like the same with Fortnite, right? You can say the same with Fortnite, and I can fucking agree with you. That is true. But the difference is... Bless me. Is the fact that... The fact is... That's part of a story. A story. It's part of a fucking story. Same with Overwatch. Yes, I know they do the same thing when Blizzard does it. But it's part of the story. So Cameron, if you watch my video, and for all you guys that are watching this and see me rambling on about this one person that I'm talking about in this video, which I didn't say I was going to make about, I do apologise, is that if you come across this video... Fuck you, right? Fuck you. I don't care what you say to Tyler. I don't care what you have to say. If you get anything to say, you can say it to me on Instagram or Snapchat or fucking Xbox. I don't care. Because you're actually being a fucking idiot. Dying Light 2 is irrelevant now. Look on Twitch. I will happily even display the number count on screen if you wish. Okay? If you don't believe me, I will happily display it. So anyway guys, back to what I was talking about before I end this video off. There is changes coming to the channel, there's updates coming to the Discord server, there will be some new releases for games coming out very soon, so I might do some streams on that but then a couple of you guys did ask, did ask me to return overwatch so if you guys want me to return overwatch let me know in the comments or i'll put a vote up and if you guys want to see overwatch i'll happily do overwatch and hopefully mark should be fine with that and a few other people as well so yeah guys that's basically all i wanted to talk about in this video i'm sorry if this was just mostly a rant video me fucking roasting uh, well not roasting but calling out fucking Cameron um, and also guys if you follow him on Twitch right for the people from Massey that's followed him be sure to unfollow him
Or if you want to keep following him, that's up to you. I'm not going to force you what the fuck to do. It's up to you if you want to follow that dickhead or not. He doesn't fucking really post much anyway. All he does is... He's fucked up his schedule. I sorted his schedule out and he's fucked it. So, follow him if you want. He doesn't really get any views anyway. Because, you know... His content's just fucking boring anyway. Um, but yeah, um, thanks for watching this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. So it was mostly a rant video. Um, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.